Hallelujah. Amen. Praise God. Presentation to the congregation. You may face the congregation. Ladies and gentlemen, I present to you the newly wedded couple. The latest couple in the universe. Barrister, Mr. and Barrister, Mrs. Uloko Sam and Deborah Paul and Nenche Hutton. Rise, let's give a shout of praise. If you are excited, hallelujah. Somebody give it up. Glory. Can we all stand up on our feet and give the Lord a praise? Give him a bigger, bigger, bigger clap and a louder shout of praise. Ideally, as the father of the bride, I am not meant to come out today at all, but I have to do this very important assignment, and that is to welcome our father in the Lord, who came all the way from Lagos. He took the journey from, from 5 a.m. this morning to be able to be here at this time. Sir, we thank you for the sacrifice. We thank you for the sacrifice. Our mama is here as well. And we appreciate for the sacrifice. We shall now receive them up to release the parental blessing on the couple. Can we remain standing as to receive Papa and Mama to come up and release upon the couple the parental blessing? This is my season of embrace. I am lost in your love. Your mercy is a are the most valuable assets in the kingdom. Blessings cause men to prevail where others struggle. The blessings of their fathers have made you to prevail above the generations before you. That was the verdict on Joseph. He could not be destroyed because of the blessing. He could not be shot by Potiphar because of the blessing. He could not be depressed in the prison because of the blessing. He arrived in the palace because of the blessing. By the blessings of today, you shall prevail Amen. where others struggle. Amen. Your generation don't have as much value for blessings. But we in the before generation before you, we know what it means. It's a wet bitterly for the blessing. Nothing makes the journey of life simple and cheap than parental blessings received in faith. Therefore, today, we stand here to proclaim you blessed. Amen. Proclaim this union blessed. Amen. You shall be fruitful. Amen. Your marriage shall be peaceful. You shall raise great children. Amen. No devil shall come between you. Amen. You shall not know separation. Amen. You shall not smell divorce. Amen. This union shall be an exemplary one. Amen. Others who desire to get this kind of marriage. Amen. 
you shall not disappoint any of us. Amen. You shall be a joy for life. Amen. In the name of Jesus. This, sick, this you know is declared sickness free. Amen. Turbulence free. Amen. This you know is a moment to defeat. Amen. A moment to failure. Amen. You shall be laughing all the way through. Amen. Amen. The fountain of your joy will not run dry. Amen. You will not know tears. In the name of Jesus. Amen. When I began teaching on heat free marriage, people were laughing. Let's watch what will happen. They have watched it now for years. It hasn't changed a bit. I therefore decree heaven's verdict on heat free marriage Amen. on your union. Amen. And so shall it be. Amen. As hand is laid on you, yes. be blessed. And um, be blessed. In the name of Jesus Christ. May everyone beholding this today go back home with this blessing. May everyone on the line for marriage receive their miracle. May every established home remain established. May every joyful home remain ever joyful. May every challenged family receive a miracle today. In the name of Jesus Christ. In the same vein, I decree the parents blessed on both sides. It shall be joy and rejoicing forever. There shall be no concern over this marriage. But testimonies all the way. In the name of Jesus Christ. And so shall it be. Let's give the Lord a big hand of praise. We praise your name, oh Lord. We give you all the praise. Yeah. Oh, Lord, 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 L